the F-35 test pilots are preparing for their most dangerous challenge to date. The F-35B is designed to stop in mid-air before landing vertically using immense downward thrust, like a rocket in reverse. But it can only do that if it's as light as possible. Any unexpended weapons brought back or any unburnt fuel would have to be ditched into the sea. So the deceptively simple plan is to add forward speed to the vertical landing, flying half like a rocket and half like a plane to give extra lift under the wings. So far, the pilots have just been making tentative approaches to test speed and height combinations. But no one has yet attempted a shipborne, rolling, vertical landing for real. The man who will attempt the world's first ever shipborne, rolling, vertical landing is Pete Whizzer Wilson. I'm excited. Uh, actually, really, um, I'm tingling, you know, I'm tingling with, with uh, anticipation for going out and doing it. And about every two minutes, I'm playing it back in my head. Whizzer has to get this just right. His rate of descent and speed must be exact. The slightest mistake now, and he could smash into the deck and become a fireball. Alright, why is the speed not gone to where I wanted it to? Wave off, wave off, wave off. First attempt, too high and too fast. Whizzer goes round again. All right, 2.3 on the gas. We're doing all right. This could be last second. He must now follow those guidelines all the way. That horizontal line halfway down is his point of no return. Beyond that, there's no turning back. He'll be committed to land. Wave off, wave off, waving off. Second attempt, too fast, too low. Another two seconds and he would have been committed and probably crash landed. Let's take it around for another go. If Whizzer can't land this time, he may have to abandon the SRVL altogether. Okay, coming down now. All right, it's just turning around a little bit. It's below 200 feet. Okay, coming down now. I'm on the center line. I'm on the center line. All right, looking good. I'm on the center line, slightly low now. A little low. Indicating good. On center line. There's one 50 feet, 140. Committed. Deppy. A lot of noise. Touchdown. On center line. On the brakes. And off the brakes. And stationary. Beautiful. That was so exciting, and to finally get the first one done and then see it happen just like it happens in the simulator was just the most special experience of my entire career, I think. Uh, there, it wasn't without its stress, you know, at the time it didn't work out exactly perfectly as we intended it to, uh, but we ultimately executed it safely and professionally. Uh, we got the data that we wanted and now we're ready to move on and do more and I'm looking forward to doing the next one because that was pretty special.